Ray and I decided that it would be important tonight to mark this occasion, this time of a new covenant, by signing a covenant. Ray as the chair of the Aboriginal Ministries Council and myself as the 40th moderator. And I invite our 41st moderator elect here to read this covenant, Gary Patterson. We are so grateful that uh, tonight we will be signing a covenant that you are entering into, as are we all, but you in a particular way of leadership. So Gary is going to read the covenant for us, and then you will know what Ray and I are signing. This, this covenant is signed on the 17th day of August 2012 by the moderator of the United Church of Canada and the chair of the Aboriginal Ministries Council. In the presence of God and of the commissioners of the 41st General Council of the United Church of Canada, in recognition of the decisions made this week by the 41st General Council, in celebration of the work begun through the establishment of the Aboriginal Ministries Council and in rejection of all historical attitudes which imposed European cultural norms as a condition of accepting the gospel. This covenant is made to declare that the basis of union will hereafter be read within the context of the words added to the introduction, declarations, and formation parts of the manual that remind us of the place of the indigenous church within the story of the formation of the United Church of Canada, to proclaim symbolically through the revised crest that all peoples are equally welcome in the United Church of Canada and to affirm our commitment to walking together, following Christ on a path towards right relations. And leading elder Lorna standing ready, I wonder, could I invite you up to stand with us as we sign? <laughs> 